episode six, the title is A Malcolm. A Malcolm is Jamie's uh, alias as he's working as a printer in Edinburgh. The print shop is a refit of the apothecary. The apothecary shop. Uh, from uh, oh, season two, from Paris. Yeah. It's just an iconic set from the book, which meant that it should be a big, beautiful, iconic set in the show. It doesn't actually match the book description, because what we did is we found the exterior just off the actual Royal Mile in Edinburgh. And the exterior had stairs that, that you know, go up to the door, so Gary Steele put on a second floor. Gary designed it with every detail imaginable, so he had two working printing presses built, and we uh, sent Sam to printing school, <laughs> and he learned how to work them and to print, and he actually printed out quite a few of the uh, pamphlets that uh, we use in the show. The heart of this episode is the intimacy. And the nice thing we all agreed on is let's let this breathe. Just let the characters get to know each other after 20 years. I think there's 20 pages plus in a room above the brothel. Not only the, the actors, but we had 20 crewmen sitting in there working along with them. So uh, intimate is definitely the word uh, to, <laughs> that, that, that went along yeah. with filming. You're the most beautiful woman I've ever seen. There's a beat where Jamie longingly looks at, it, at, at this woman he's been dreaming about for all these years, and, and, and instead of Claire opening up, she actually becomes bashful. And it, it shows age, too. It shows that people become insecure. I mean, she checks her hair in, before she even walks in the print shop, and then Jamie yeah. is like, oh, I wear glasses now, I hope that's okay. Like they could ever be unattractive, but you know, it's a very real feeling. No matter how beautiful you are, you're, you're nervous, and I like how they played their nervousness. Right. We have to show that they've aged. You know, it's, it's hard to do with, with the actors who haven't aged 20 years. We played around with a lot of different looks and a lot of makeup tests to kind of figure out where we wanted to go, and ultimately it felt like a little bit of weathering on the face, some gray in each of their hair. You know, hers reads easier than his because her hair is dark. But the glasses were much easier. Once he puts on those reading glasses, it just tells you, oh, he's, he's gotten older. And so it was, a, it was a shorthand to sort of move their ages forward. We had a lot of discussions about that. And I think we landed on something that everyone was happy with. 